In this video, you'll learn how to create swirly text animation in After Effects. By the way, you can download this template from the link in the description below. You can also join me on Patreon to get the latest updates and free After Effects projects. All right, let's start the video. Let's create a new composition. I am using full HD resolution size at 24 frames per second. For the duration, I choose 5 seconds. First, I create a new solid layer, name it as a background, and for this, I'm using a light yellowish color. Then, I add a text into our composition. Make sure text size is big enough. And then I align it to the center. And then, I pre-compose this layer as a text. After that, I am going to add rectangle shape layer. Then I rename this layer as a noise. Then I search an effect called fractal noise and add it to this layer. Let's change its settings. First, I change the fractal type to swirly. And then I open the transform property. Here I change scale to 400 and then I change the complexity to 1 so we will get this look. And then I search a colorama effect and add it to this layer. And then I open the output cycle options and in this panel you can see various presets but I choose ramp gray option. After that I change the white color point position like this and then I move the black color point to this position although I change its color to dark gray. And then I add one more color point here. And then I change the cycle repetition to 5 to get this kind of look. Then I open the input phase and here we can change the phase to animate this design. So I add a keyframe on the phase shift. Then I drag the keyframe around one second and then I change its value to 74. Then I hold Alt on the keyboard and click on the stopwatch to reveal the expression panel and here I write a loop, out expression. So this way it will animate in a loop. After that I pre-compose this noise layer and name it as a noise map. And then I turn off this layer, also select the text layer and then I search a effect called Compound Blur. And then I add it to this layer. Let's change Blur Amount to around 90. And then I change the Blur layer to Noise Map. After that I use Levels Effects, so I add it to this layer. Then I change Channel to Alpha. And then I change the Histogram like this, so it will sharpen the design. It's looking very sharp. So I am going to add a Gaussian Blur effect into this layer and then I change blurriness to around 20 and once again I added a Levels effect into this layer and then I change the channel to Alpha and once again I change the histogram so we get this look. And now it's looking much better. One more thing I want to share with you that if you want to change the randomness of this design so simply go to the Noise Map layer, then select the Noise layer and search Random Seed. Then go to the window and here you will find the essential graphics. Simply add it to the Composition panel and then choose Primary layer to Noise Map. And then drag and drop the Random Seed property to this box. Now when you close this Essential Graphics panel, so you will see in our Noise Map Layer Properties, you will find Essential Properties and here we can change the Random Seed very easily to get a different look. Now it's time to add a final touch. Let's add a new Adjustment Layer. And then add a Noise Effect into this layer. Now change the noise amount to 15 to enhance the look. Also, I uncheck the Use Color Noise option. And that's it. You got swirly text animation in After Effects. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.